paper published in late August 2019 in Current Biology finds that plants are going extinct 350 times faster than the historical average. This should not come as a major surprise for followers of this channel, but 350 times faster than the historical norm is a big number, the likes of which you rarely see in mainstream media outlets. It's difficult to measure the rate of extinction, as pointed out in the paper, but it's relatively easy and straightforward to compare historical and prehistorical changes to contemporary changes. And as I pointed out repeatedly on this channel, the rate of change is what's tremendously important. If plant species are going extinct 350 times faster than normal, then as expected, the organisms that depend upon those plants can't keep up with that rate of change. And as my co-host and friend Kevin Hester points out frequently, it can only be worse than we know. So if a, if a study finds that species are going, plant species are going extinct 350 times faster than historical norms, I'd be willing to bet the number is considerably higher than 350. It can only be worse than we are being told because that's the conservative nature of science and the conservative nature of the corporate media, never mind the governments. So yes, species are going extinct at a stunningly rapid rate, and that's going to have consequences for all of us as a result of the co-extinctions mentioned in the Strona and Bradshaw paper from 2018. This is just another tidbit, another brick on the pile indicating the rapidity with which species are going extinct and suggesting the consequences for all organisms as a result. At the edge of extinction, only love remains.